The poem Lycidas by John Milton is an elegy written in the form of a pastoral poem. It was written in 1639 to lament the accidental death of Milton's friend Edward King. He died by drowning. The theme of the elegy is essentially mournful and sadly reflective. It is usually a lamentation of the dead. Though lyrical, it is not spontaneous and it is often the result of deliberate poetic art. Death, which seems to be the primary theme of most elegies, is a vast evocative theme. It leads the poet to regions of reflections usually lying beyond the lyrical imagination. The poem Lycidas can be conveniently divided into six sections, a prologue, four main parts, and an epilogue. In the prologue, that is, lines 1 to 24, Milton invokes the muse and explains the reasons for writing the poem. Although Milton had decided not to write poetry till his powers matured, bitter constraint and sad occasion compels or forces the poet to attempt to write the elegy. The occasion that led to the writing of this elegy is the untimely death of his friend Edward King. The speaker mentions that they together had begun their study early in the morning and had continued throughout the day late into the night. But now his friend Edward King, who is projected as Lycidas, is dead. Milton laments the death of Lycidas in the manner of traditional elegiac poets. He asks the muse where she had been when her Lycidas was dying and adds that even her presence would not have saved him. This leads to reflections and thoughts on the nature and meaning of life and death and of fate and fame. Fame is the reward a man gets for living the laborious days of life. But in the case of Edward King and Lycidas, as one is about to receive his reward of fame, all of a sudden fate alters and death happens. In the precariousness of human life, therefore, lies the tragic irony. But Milton rejects the idea of pure earthly reputations as the true reward of life. According to him, the true reward is in the divine judgment which a person will get after death. It will be the reward for his good deeds on earth. The speaker opens the poem by talking to some flowers, telling them about his emergence shortly to pick their berries and to trim their leaves. Laurel here refers to a small evergreen tree which is often associated with poetry and with the Greek god Apollo. The speaker has been harshly picking up the berries even before they are matured to be plucked. The speaker then passes the information that he had confronted some terribly sad news, which the reader knows to be the death of Lycidas. It was his fate to lose his life at a young age, and this fact compels the poet to disturb nature before its due season. The speaker asked a rhetorical question as to who would not like to write poetry for a person like Lycidas. He himself replies that it is quite impossible to not write poetry on him because he was not simply a poet but a poet who wrote in the lofty, sublime style.